Hey guys, so I apologize so much. I haven't posted anything about me maxing my Iron Man on YouTube. And it's so sad, guys. After I maxed on Old School RuneScape, I think I maxed on stream. And I'll show you a clip of that right here. Oh, I'm gonna go. Oh god, this is a big moment. Okay, ready? Boom! Oh, whoa. Oh my god, can someone take a screenshot? Oh, they're great. They're orange and red. I love that. Oh my god, let's go get the Max Inferno cape. Oh my god. So yeah, after I maxed, I just... I took a really long break because I was moving. I live in a different city now. I'm married. And I just needed to kind of get settled with moving because I don't know about y'all, but if you know anything, moving freaking sucks. Sucks bad. And it's a lot of work. And I was in a new town. I'm living on a military base now. It was just like a completely different life. Um, and recently I've just come back and I'm playing a hardcore iron, which I'm really enjoying. And so I'm still going to be playing my main. In fact, I've gotten a two mil wood cutting XP and things like that. Working on Hydra, three Hydra leathers, actually four if you continue the ferocious gloves. Um, there's a lot of things I want to do on my main, you know, I want to do more Inferno, but first I'm going to get my Dragon Hunter Lance. I'm about 800 Hydra KC, haven't seen it yet. Um, really want to get that so I can start doing solo raids and build up to solo challenge mode raids because I really want that muted isle pet because um, I already have Ulm as a pet. I don't know. It feels really good, guys. Um, also, there's kind of like a shock of maxing an Iron Man on RuneScape. And I think that that was truly... It was shocking for me. Like, after I maxed, I played this account for three and a half years, you know? And so to max and to not have anything to level was shocking and kind of like, well, what do I do now, you know? And I think that put me in a burnout phase and, you know, for a couple months, probably a month and a half, I just didn't know what to do or play. And with everything new in life, I just kind of needed a break to myself, needed a break from my YouTube channel. Um, and it was great. And now I'm back making some guides, starting a new series. Uh, it was a really great refresher. And I have some hobbies I'm into now. I'm not working, so I have a lot of time to invest and to be making videos and hang out with you guys and to run my clan chat. Um, and I'm very excited about the clan update. So I want to get a sigil from Corporal Beast. That's a big deal for me. Um, definitely want to get that Lance. I want to go back to the Inferno and get better and better at it. But, you know, I've got so many things now that I want to do on this iron. It's overwhelming again. Um, my hardcore Iron Man's almost out of the membership, so if anyone wants to donate a bond so I can continue, continue that series, that would be bay. I just bought membership on this account, um, but I don't really want to pay for two accounts, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm, t I'm hyped, dude. We're just gonna get more dupes, we're gonna get new items, um, you know, we can raid all day, raid all night. I really want some more TOB items. I don't know if y'all know this, but... My TOB KC is 212, and I only have two items. So basically, I'm on the rate of 1 in 100. Like, every 100 raids, I get one item, and the only thing I have is two Avernic Defenders. So they're duplicates. It's it's pretty bad. Um, so I'm really hoping to get new uniques for that and things like that. A Sanguinesti would be incredible for solo raids, and... You know, things like that. So, you know, that that's basically the goals. And, you know, it was just a shock. It was truly a shock. I never thought I would max an iron. Never thought I would get Inferno. Never thought I would get Bandos, Armadillo, Twisted Bow. Like, all of this is very surreal. And it's a bit of a shock, you know. And I think maxing was that real moment. Like, oh my god, what do I do now? I never expected this. So... Um, but I'm here, and I'm continuing it, and I'm going to see how far I can get on my hardcore Iron Man without dying. I will die eventually. I'm aware of that. Everyone does. But it'll be fun to see how far I can get and if I'll be able to max that hardcore. I doubt it. It's just not likely with this game being DC Scape but, and with my, my internet. But you know what? We're just going to risk it for the biscuit and go for it, you know? 
Um, but thanks for watching, guys, and I, I appreciate the continuous support. Um, I'm so sorry about not saying or making a video on me maxing. Truly, it was just, it was a lot. It was a lot and kind of surreal and like almost kind of a private thing. Like, this is a very intimate account to me over three and a half years, and I love this game so much. And to Max, it was like an intimate moment. I don't know. Weird, dude. I don't know how to explain it. But I'm back, and thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you next time. Bye.